Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. First of all, click on Start Lab and open the console incognito window. Now here, just click on I understand. And if you get another kind of pop-up, you have to simply click on I agree and agree and continue. Okay. And simply after that, you have to activate the cloud shell. One more important thing, if you want to complete this lab via manual steps, a step-by-step -step video is already present in the channel. You can check it out. Now here, you have to just click on Authorize. And in this video, we'll be using the GitHub repository. The GitHub repository is present in the description box of this video. You have to come over here, scroll down and select it and paste over here. Now wait for this command to execute. And after that, we have to do one manual step and we'll be done with the lab guys. So just stay tuned. Also, if you get any kind of error, do not worry about it. It's normal. Okay, if you get any kind of error, do not worry. Just wait and rerun the command again. It will surely work. Okay. So just wait for it and for the last task we have to do it manually so stay tuned till the end of the video like if you get this kind of error do not worry it will start to redeploy again you see like this you have to just check the score for all the tasks up to task number six and after that you have to just type y and hit enter now come to the lab instruction and check the score you have to navigate to task number six and many of you are asking how to enable this yellow check my progress bar you can check the description box i've shared the detailed video now here just try to check the score here you can see task number six minimum instance just come over here and simply check the score like this just come over here and check the score if you get the score, then come back again to the lab instructions and just type Y and hit enter and wait for it to get completed. And at last, we have to modify one more instance. Here you will get 10 out of 100. Okay, sorry, 20. Now just come to the basically our what we say console. Close the cloud shell. From the search box, just type cloud run function or just type run. You have to select cloud run function. And from here only, we have to modify the function. Okay. See, here, if you get any kind of error, you can see revision scaling should be 4 and maximum number of concurrent requests should be 100. So, click on the slow concurrent function. And from here, just click on edit and redeploy function. Click on it, edit. And basically, you have to just scroll down just scroll down and cross verify and then you have to run the deploy button okay so just scroll down basically and just check whether the maximum or minimum number of instance is same as for yes you can see it's four only now just click on deploy it will take few seconds and then we'll be done with the lab guy you can clearly see all things are completed now just come to the lab instruction and check the score you'll get full score do like the video and subscribe the channel guys